most likely we have a cancel Jorge Co uh, Jorge Cota. Okay. And uh, because he had a COVID last time, so we have a, a a contract with them. So most likely this is where we go okay. with the uh, with Cota. All right. What's March. next with David Benavides? David Benavides, he will fight the same day, most likely. Oh, oh no, David Benavides. Yeah, he, he will fight the uh, early March. Any opponent? Uh, well, there's not too many that you want to take the fight, though. Mm -hmm. So you just We're looking at looking. stay busy. Any, any, any location? Like any? Uh, is there like a, a going to be an attempt to have it? It, where where we could have fans or is it probably going to be a closed studio well, I, fight? I would love to do it in Arizona, mm. but uh, I spoke with the commissioner and um, the problem that uh, now is totally closed, you know. Yeah. So there's nothing we can do. Hey, what about Texas? Uh, as far as Benavidez, uh, listen, I was at the WBC convention last year and there was a lot of chatter about Jose Benavidez when he was a champion, possibly facing Jamal Charlo. Now that Benavidez isn't a champion, does it make sense to maybe do that fight at a catchway or make Jamal the champion come up to 68 to face Benavidez? I, 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 listen, Benavidez, he will fight anyone, regardless. The, the issue with the, which I believe is the, the money involved. And I don't know if it's a pay-per-view though. And I can tell you that uh, Benavides is one of the kind of boxer that he wants to be the best and he will be, and he is to me, the best 168, super middleweight. Do you he have his issue before, but always I keep like, you know, I treat like my own son, like I treat every one of my boxers. And um, and he have my support for his decision because he had the opportunity to fight in uh, in 175. And he say, no, I'm a 68. And the opportunity with a big money and for a world title. Mm. And he make a decision that, uh, that what he was is the, remember he was the first, uh, few fights or events I, after the, you know, when, when he started to be the protocol and, and, and the bubbles. So he, he was not aware of the whole situation of the timing of the gym and all that. That is the reason he make the weight. It's not because he's not a professional because he's, you know, he underestimate the bubble, put it that way. Got it. Uh, do you think he will be called as Canelo's mandatory? And do you think Canelo actually gives him a shot or takes franchise status again? This is exactly the same like uh, Fortune and Henny. It's not, uh, it's, in this moment, the boss is uh, Canelo. So he will make the decision and his team. I have a, such a good relation with Eddie Reynoso that he had the most respect for me. And I know Eddie from many, many, many years. Actually, I gave him a few opponents to uh, Canelo in the beginning of his uh, career. And, and I worked with Eddie Reynoso in several uh, shows in Mexico that I did with him as a partnership. So we have a, you know, a, a way that we can discuss the, the opportunity, but till now, he never called me or mentioned David Benavides, and he must have his own reason, and I respect that reason, because if I'm in his uh, shoe, <laughs> I would say the same thing, what I need Benavides for. You know what I mean? He's, he's the, probably the most dangerous fighter uh, that uh, Canelo will fight. What about the rumors that... Um PBC wants a Caleb Plant fight with them. That 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 everything's leading towards that. Who? Uh, Canelo. David, da no, no, David Benavides. David Benavides will Plant. fight tomorrow. Uh, Plant. Plant. Do you he think that his, fight happens uh, this year? Uh, I, I I don't know because he have his personal issue. Oh, okay. Between both of them. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, in my case, about business, nothing personal. Yes. 
a bad boxer is personal. All right, and got... respect. And I believe the plan he didn't respect Benavides. Mm. And that is the reason that he really want to fight him. But in the end of the day, like I told him to plan myself, is the opportunity because it's a great fight that is supposed to be people. Yeah. Because not only for the money, because it's different to do it in a four by four and enjoy the fight. Samson, mm. you only have Without two minutes before your, your next appointment, so I just want to get in uh, an update on Jason Rosario. Uh, it will be back most likely in uh, April or May, and it will have a, a, a big fight, nothing small. Mm. So kind of like a comeback type of fight? Beautiful. That's correct. Got it. Smart. Well, Samson, man, I want to thank you, obviously, for coming on. Uh, so happy that you're up to date with technology. Thank you. You made yeah. this uh, no, perfect. You knocked this out the park, uh, Samson. I, really, I was hitting, Sam, thank I was, you so much. I was calling out here all God morning. Bless you all. Hey, and bless by the you. way, happy new year. Because happy new uh, year. By, by the way, this last year, the 2020, is, I don't count it for me. So I still underage, put it that way. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Let's go, champ. <laughs> hey, so Samson. I, I, don't, I, I don't have no birthday for the for this year. Are you going on vacation? Really <laughs> <laughs> are, are, Let's go, champ. You feel me? God bless you all. All right. God bless you. God bless you, all right. all right. God bless you brother. You. I'm so desperate for a vacation. I tried to ask him, is he going on one? Because it's like, he said he's turning <laughs> off his phone for the next seven days. Oh, if you enjoyed the video, feel free to hit the like, subscribe, and share. As always, if you want to support us to the next level, head over to the patreon.com backslash the boxing voice. We have tons of exclusive from Border Wars, Entitled, Betting Shows, the list goes on and on and on. But in addition to that, if you guys have questions for fighters, trainers, and promoters, this is where you can submit them. We will run out. Get these questions answered and put it back on the show just for you guys. Appreciate it. Peace.